Hi everyone, I'm Karthi Gopalan from Texas Instruments here in Silicon Valley. So much of the world is depending more and more on the accurate detection and measurement of elements such as toxic gas, carbon dioxide concentration, pressure, temperature, and pH, to name just a few. Texas Instruments offers a set of sensor AFE devices that process and convert these measurement signals with great precision. Let's take pH levels. There are many industries that need accurate pH measurements in all sorts of applications, including food processing, water quality monitoring, chemical processing, emission monitoring, and more. When you're designing these types of pH sensor platforms, you face analog technical challenges. You can face extreme temperature variations and high output impedances as high as 100 mega ohms, offsets and drifts, grounding and guarding, and you need to reduce the cost of ownership and design smaller systems, all the while increasing system accuracy. And now, TI has just added a new member to this family, helping you solve your design challenges in pH sensor platforms with the release of a new configurable sensor analog front end, the LMP91200. As part of TI's advanced family of sensor solutions, the LMP91200 delivers the industry's first integrated pH sensor circuit, which interfaces with all of today's pH sensors, bridging the gap between the sensor and the microprocessor. Designed for two electrode sensors, this device provides all of the functionality for detecting changes based on a delta voltage at the sensor. The LMP91200 is optimized for low power applications operating over a range of 1.8 to 5.5 volts and it offers you a number of other key features like low input bias current as low as 0.4 picoamps, automatic temperature compensation, programmable current source, onboard sensor testing, active guarding and many more. What's really important here is that LMP91200 is a fully integrated solution which greatly simplifies your design while giving you well-defined best-in-class performance. It is that integration that enables smaller total solutions and allows for easy reuse of your designs. Your designs are now simpler as you have no need for additional high accuracy components. And to meet one of your biggest design challenges, the LMP91200 offers you a very low power consumption as well as no destruction of the pH electrode in a no supply situation. The 91200 is a configurable solution, giving the user more flexibility during operation and reducing logistical overhead with programming on the fly. This programmability basically enables a modular approach to your design and helps you get your product to market much faster. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Here on the bench, we have a pH sensor solution with a pH sensor in the glass, a RTD in the glass too, for temperature compensation, a hot plate to vary the temperature of the pH solution, the LMP91200 evaluation board, and an SPIO4 data capture board hooked up through the USB cable to my laptop. Now, let's look at the software environment. As the software powers up, you want to go through the step-by-step -step help instructions highlighted on the left of the screen. You also have the option to take an interactive virtual device tour. Now, let's get started. In your first step, you select a sensor by going to the sensor database. When you click the pH sensor type, you see a list of sensor offerings. Click on the sensor that you have hooked up to the system. A dialog box will pop up telling you what the jumper configuration for this particular sensor should be. We took care of that in this case. The building blocks are pre-configured for you. For example, click on this colored PGA. It shows you that the register has been configured to a PGA gain of 5. You can also custom program these blocks if you choose to do so. Now go to the measurement tab and we'll start with the pH measurement. Our first measurement is without temperature compensation. We'll assume that the liquid is at room temperature or 25 degrees C and we have the output format in pH. Then click run. You can see that the pH value is 9.7. Now 
Let's click the measured real time temperature button. The device will use the RTD in the liquid bath to get the actual temperature. Click run and this will deliver a more accurate pH measurement, in this case 9.3. If you want even more accuracy, choose the two steps or the three steps algorithm depending on your accuracy needs. The tool will walk you through this. On the left of this panel, you see that the tools show you the measured system performance, which includes mean and noise performance too. Now that I've walked you through this tool and given you a short overview, you can see that this is an extremely easy to use tool, which gives you fast prototyping ability, a great feature of the new LMP91200. And the 91200 is a fully enabled within TI's online simulation and design tool, Webbench. You can get a lot more information on the LMP91200 and the whole sensor AFE family, along with information on our ultra low power MSP430s and 4 to 20 milliamp loop solutions from Texas Instruments by visiting us at ti.com slash sensor AFE. That will wrap up things for this video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again next time.